always be cool here? You're in like a cave system. Uh, this cave system is really close to the frozen area. So yeah, it is usually cold when you hide up. Huh. Totally forgot you could teleport. But they do like bananas kind of to their advantage, I guess. That is their elemental weakness, apparently. Mm-hmm. The banana element. Mm-hmm. Banana vendors. <laughs> they just have like banana pudding in like tankards. Yeah. They're like chugging it. Uh. Mm. Well, not as many shrines out in the desert as I, I thought, but then again, it is the desert. There's a few out here. We, yeah, we haven't really explored the desert per se either. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta. We gotta cross dress ourselves up here. Yep. Oh hey, is that her? What? No, that that can't be the same. Uh, Check that was kidnapped. No. Wait, can, no. can you put on a thunder helmet? I already looked. No. Oh. It is a prize you can get. Oh. If you do all of the missions in the entire Gerudo village, uh, including the one really hard one to do, then you they give it to you. Uh, sorry, they let you borrow it, quote unquote, aka a video game logic way of saying we're not giving it to you to keep, but you can use it. Really funny. Oh, wait, the little girl's gone. If you're looking for. Oh, okay, I'm not. If you're, if you're looking for Lady Reju, she's on the second floor of my packs. Normally, people aren't allowed into my packs, but she's given you permission, it seems. You're like, no, no, I'm good. Be on your best manners. If she deems you as a disturbance to her, it will not end well for you. She just tapped that sword in the ground and like the entire place fissures. An earthquake every time she shakes mm -hmm. her sword. It's called to my eyes on you. <laughs> yep. Oh, there she is. Wow, she has really long hair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ha, I wait for you. Oh yeah, you need to see it. See the little girl with, with Texas kind of Grudo, I can sense the power of the heirloom flowing through you. I know that you succeeded. As I am, you no doubt noticed, still but a child. Mm. People look at me with nothing but warmth in their eyes, but even this brings me some pain. I must admit. I've tried so hard to be worthy of their love, to be worthy, chief, and to prove myself that I was worthy too. When my family heirloom was stolen, I felt as though a shadow had fallen over me. Yeah, the Yiga clan. Yet your arrival in the midst of all this must be the work of Lady Urubosa. Who? The Gerudo champion. Oh. Valley. Oh yeah, that's right. Now please give me them. I totally forgot main plot. Huh? Who? Yeah. Here, I've been using it as a shit bucket. Uh, how do I look? Like a child wearing a giant helmet. It's not even a helmet, it's like a mask. Mm -hmm. Oh, flashback? Mm-hmm. Whoa. Oh, I guess we'll shush for this. Well, you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much from the princess's own appointed knight. She was out on a survey all day today, still as the sands now. So, spill it, boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? <laughs> it's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. She gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's Remember not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, 
She's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this sealing power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. You be sure to protect her with your life. It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... Medusa! What was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you... What are you doing here? <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> it's a good thing to know Lady Urubosa was not without her sense of humor. <laughs> Truthfully, I think she's like one of the... She's like the only champion that actually seemed to like Link. Yeah, well, she knows that you have a thing for the princess. Ah. She's the only one that figured it out. Wow. Other than Fish Waifu, who actually had a thing for you. Yep. And Link was so dumb, he didn't realize it until after she died. And then he was like, well, it's my opportunity to make up. He's there. What's wrong? You just stared. Anyway, what matters now is how, how is it? Do we look all right? <laughs> I um, was going with the second option. I'm sorry. I would just would. It's a tad big. <laughs> she kills you on spot. <laughs> oh, it tilted. Yeah. <laughs> you don't say. She'll grow into it eventually. Yep. The threat <laughs> Divine Beast Va Naboris poses only grown since we began searching for the airline. I believe the Gerudo town itself may be in danger before too long. As chief and as Gerudo, I must find some way of stop that thing before it threatens my people. Will you help me? Nah, not right now. Uh, of course. <laughs> of course. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> Who'd have thought that just before, just before such a momentous battle, your simple confidence pledge of support from you would be what puts me at ease? I'll head out now. Let's meet up at Lookout Post, south of town. There's only one way to get that close to divorce, and that's with the help of the Saiyan Seal. This, this motherfucking part, it's so like motherfucking say this motherfucking goddamn motherfucking part with the motherfucking, motherfucking camel, motherfucking last motherfucking battle. Check mark on, on adult content on this video. Go on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the Lookout Post isn't too far from town, but you should take the sand steel there. You can get practice in that way. Yeah, not enough practice for this fight. I'll be waiting for you with my favorite sand seal, Patricia. Aww. <laughs> that, the, yeah. that helmet tilt. Still, is it really that? <laughs> it, it really is a little big. She actually says that even if you say you look good. And if you say that you look fine in it, she's like, nah, you're just being flattering. <laughs> Oh yeah, you've had that temporary stamina wheel like this whole time. Yep. Just climb up the waterfall, you know, no big deal. <laughs> if you had the waifu shirt on, you could. Yeah, I could, but it would be silly to watch myself climb up the tiny waterfall. Whoa, whoa, wait, there's a sword in there. In the water. Oh, yeah, it's a rest oh, of oh. It should be something awesome. That, that's not a spot you would really go exploring. Right. You're supposed to take a sand seal there. You're not going? Uh, no, it's you're, fucking hot out here. You're not gonna be a drift king? I'm gonna be a drift king in this entire fight we have to go through. It's fucking ridiculous. Uh, okay. Of course, Worlds Collide did this one shot. Oh, I'm sure. He's legendary for um, being really innately good at any video game he plays. Honestly, a playtester would be a pretty good profession if video games nowadays didn't have a, uh, a knack for being incredibly flashy. Well, not just that. I think he would have too much of a bias. He'd be like, hey, uh, you made this part too easy. 
went through it really fast. <laughs> All video games would be harder if he played Destiny. Yeah. The only way they could counter that is if they have like someone that just really can't get the hang of video games. Yeah. A playtester that sucks at the job. Like, if I were a playtester. No, I mean, like, if you want to make your game viable for anyone, whether they've played games all their life or not at all, right? that'd be a great bias to have, is to have someone who's just who's really, really, really bad. Who's really good at it, and someone who's really, really bad at yeah. it. Yeah, so that way, if the person really good at it is still having fun, and the person that's really bad at games can still actually play and have fun, right. you're doing then a good job. Then it's at least worth it. Right. I, would, I would say this. I would say uh, Nintendo games fall in that category pretty well. Oh, whoa! Oh, just take me. your stuff. Take oh, your poopy bow. You can keep it. Sneak into her bedroom uninvited. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely not her bedroom, but I appreciate your gesture. No, it, there was a bed in there. Mm -hmm. And it was a room, and she was in there. Oh, hey, a little girl. She, how did she get there before you? She told you she took her sand seal. Oh, okay. We walked, which is why we walked, so it looked like she got there before us logically. Oh, okay. Do it! Yeah, we got this. Yeah. Count on you to shoot... Oh. Oh, oh. We don't have any bomb arrows. You used your last one. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, lightning. Oh... Boy. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah, uh, it casts a lot of lightning. I'm sure it does. Considering it's all about lightning. I mean, all the other ones had different elements. Mm -hmm. oh. She gives you 20. And that's all you got. That's a lot of bomb arrows, though. It will be, since we're equipping our triple bow. Ah, schnizzle. Yeah. This is the last time I'll... Wow, they know this one's hard. This is like three checks to make sure you're ready. Yeah. Yeah. This other one is like, all right, let's go. Like, yeah. 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 Exactly. Like, what? What? Oh, God. She literally asked you like three fucking times if you want to do it because it's that hard. Aw, Patricia's adorable. Mm hmm. She's blue. Yep. Abadi Abadi. Oh, you need to give her a moment? Mm hmm. She's got to do this. Praise the sun? Yep. Well, almost praise the sun. Her hands are facing the wrong direction. Palms out. Yep. By the power of Grayskull. She has the power! She has limited ability from her ancestor. Yep. Yeah, she's a descendant of Numerosa. Oh, oh yeah, I, I wouldn't expect anything less. <laughs> I feel the power coursing through me as the helmet the tilts. Helmet tilts in front of her face. <laughs> how, how does she see through it? Is what I'm wondering. I don't even know. I guess the play lenses. Even then, you'd have to be very far-eyed. <laughs> yes. yes! Yeah. Ur, ur, ur. <laughs> Those sand souls are really cool, though. I love it. She is through the helmet. Mm-hmm. The silly. giant sphere of lightning protection. You got silly. Yeah, this is difficult. You silly seal. The seal she's riding moves faster than the shield you're riding. The whole combat. So you are constantly behind her, and you are always struggling to try and stay within the sphere, so you don't get blasted to hell. Do we have lightning resist stuff? Yeah, one thing. This. Oh, and you're immediately at yep. desert. Yep. Great. Great. That's what do I was any, saying. Do we have any desert uh, potion stuff? Uh, lightning resist potions? We might have made some food that does that. Hey, look, we got the... the we got one. That one. Should we? That's high level. Mm, let's wait a little bit. Should you say that for the boss? The Ganon spawn thing? Yeah. Hey. Dash, then you get ahead of her, and she's like, hey, slow down. Oh boy. And if you fall outside of this while you're next to the thing, you just done it. Instantly. It instantly kills you. Well, great. So you would have died there. Anyway. Yep. Yep. 
Very she dash? Stay. No, she doesn't dash. But if you dash, you get ahead of the minion. Like that. Oh shit, what's going on? Ah. Where's she going? There's a shrine nearby, apparently. God damn it! My seal doesn't move like that, woman! <laughs> Are we almost there? I hope we're almost there. Nope. We haven't got hit by lightning yet. Good. I see ruins. It's kind of spooky. Oh, oh. Oh, crap. Super lightning. Oh, oh shit, 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 shit. Uh, no, 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 no. Ah. Fuck. He's dead. Oh, you didn't die. You didn't die. At least the seal stays with you. So, you're supposed to shoot those? Yeah. If fall, she's dead. Oh, why don't you just stay like this? No, keep fighting. Why don't we just sit here and just shoot? We're gonna get closer to it. Oh boy. We gotta actually get to a good spot to stop. We're gonna get right over here. Stop. Does it stop moving when Tris shoots? Nope, it walks in a circular pattern. So if we wait, if we just wait, it'll come back around to us. We don't need to go to the boss, the boss comes to us. This oh, is what this I did will last take time. forever. Over here. You're just trying to watch me die a hundred times, aren't you? It'd be more entertaining. If you want, I can try to play. I don't even know the controls or anything. No, I'd rather not. Okay, after the next time it shoots, we'll go. How about that? I'm trying to get ahead of its path, and then we'll stop there. We're in its path. We're directly in its path. It's going to walk right next to us. But we've already, it's already been like 20 minutes. <laughs> you know? It's so ridiculous. Okay, well, while we're waiting, well, just what does this remind you? Play the slow and patient way of doing the boss instead of being okay, silly and charging in there. Don't, don't do what the game wants you to do. I'm doing exactly what the game wants you to do. I took my seal to a most advantageous location right next to where it's gonna walk. <laughs> Alright, well, while we're waiting, at least this thing is an ancient blue dragon, right? Yeah, that's true. So, and that reference, is, those of you who haven't played the new DD module, um, for a fifth edition, what was that one? The giant, it was uh, something of the storm king, the storm king, storm king, something. yeah, storm king, something. Um, that uh, whole module has like a part where there's like an ancient blue dragon in it, and uh, yeah, needless to say, it's it's great. Of course, worlds collide, being like he's video games, uh, gave it a, a critical wound. We can do this. Oh, nice. Does it normally take more than one bomb? Yeah. Now that we have the triple thing, we can just do it. One more. Got it. Yeah. And you were like, hey, we need to charge in there. And I'm like, slow and steady. I was just saying, get closer to where it's walking to. You are the hare, and I am the tortoise. <laughs> Why can't we be a mix of both? <laughs> why can't we be a hairy that's, tortoise? That's why we do well as a let's play. Yeah, I guess. It's like, ugh. You're like, why hurry up, and I'm like, let's just wait, and it'll present an opportunity. You know, instead of shooting arrows at it like you do with every other guardian, wouldn't it have been way more fun to pull this, like, Star Wars? Where you, uh, where you uh, it's like an at, -AT and you just gotta tangle its legs. Yeah, that would be cool too. That would, that actually would have been a neat play in Star Wars. I have no choice but to entrust the rest to you. Of course. I'm like, I got, I'm on it. <laughs> got it. How's she walking in high heels? Those are really three inch heels. She's in the desert. Yep. Also, she's like six. No logic. 
Oh, whoa. But she's built like an Amazon. So, so maybe her incredibly bulging leg muscles are also to walk in high heels in the desert without falling to her death. I guess. We're like twisting her ankle a thousand times. Well, shit. Don't let us down, Link. Oh, he went down. <laughs> <laughs> 